Hi everyone, I know what you're thinking. It's the hummingbird guy and he's sitting on an RV-10. Well, yep, it's my RV-10, but guess what? I also do RV-10s and we've been working on something really, really hard over the last year. And I say we, it's Carol and I together. And what we've finally come up with, I know many of you have been asking, is the maintenance handbook for RVs. It's been a lot of work, probably a thousand hours between the two of us over the last year. It's about 141 pages, all hard print. I mean, you know, the uh, heavy stock paper. How many color pictures? 441 or something? Yep. Okay. Checklists, guides, recommended tools, some reprints on some of the columns that are pertinent to doing maintenance and some of the uh, sport aviation columns that I've written in the past. And, uh, you know, humbly, I will tell you, if you use this book, it will be almost as good as having me look over your shoulder. So whether you've built an RV and you've been doing your own maintenance or you're a non-builder owner and you've got a mechanic doing your maintenance, you absolutely ought to give this book to your mechanic. Okay, most of them don't know a lot about RVs. This will walk them through everything. It's very easy to use. It goes through all the individual portions of, a, a, of an aircraft, you know, starting with the airframe, the ignitions, intake, all the way down through the pedo system. It'll walk you through everything, what to look for, how to repair it, and uh, it'll help you if you need, you know, got to go get some help from somebody else too, if it's beyond your capability of doing it. So, um, one of the other things we've been working hard to do is get the price down. You know, we're currently in this uh, area of high inflation, and we heard you last time on the books, okay? It is, it's got a lot of color pictures, so that drove the price up. So we're gonna do an introductory price of $69.95 for the book in hard copy and $59.95 digital. So why digital? So you can send it to your a &P or give it to them. Now I wanna make you understand right away up front, you can't print the digital. So please don't call us and tell us you wanna print it, okay? It's the hard copy if you need the hard copy. And again, we tried to keep the cost down, but there you can see all the color pictures in here that just really drives up the print cost. And we put it on hard stock, so you can just use this for a very long time. Anyway, enjoy, hopefully you'll like it. And uh, basically it'll be available on our website, probably starting uh, late this evening, tomorrow morning. And then we're gonna work with the usual vendors that some of you are used to getting it from, uh, whether it's EAA or Aircraft Spruce, um, we'll, we're gonna get them the supplies that they need to get them out to you as well. Okay, so I know what some of you are thinking already. When are you going to do a book for kit foxes or carbon cubs or some of the other ones? So here's the answer for that. Maybe we went too much by saying for Vans RV aircraft. The reason why I did that is basically all the pictures, or the majority of them, are from Vans aircraft. That's what I spend the majority of my life working on and performing maintenance on. But the reality is about the only thing that's not covered in this book is fabric repair and composite repair. So everything else that's common to all the other airplanes, fuel systems, brakes, tires, wheels, ignition systems, magnetos, et cetera, and, and even the checklists and recommended tools, it will work for all the amateur built aircraft out there. So for those of you who maybe built one again, or you're a new owner, give this book to your mechanic and uh, it will be just like having me there, I promise.